How you guys doing? This is Johnny back here at MyMixEngineer.com. And over the next couple of days, I will be mixing the song from beginning to end, letting you guys in on my thought process and my workflow, showing you guys some tips and tricks and discussing UAD. This entire mix will be using nothing but UAD plugins, you guys. The reason why, one, UAD has been around for over 15 years. That says enough. Two, when they model an actual piece of hardware, they model the ins, the outs, the transformers, the, the tubes, the characteristics, the harmonics, the hiss. Some sound even better, but there's no complaint, you guys. It, they, want, they sound warm. All of the plugins have this warm sound that you get from analog gear. That is my personal opinion. Do not shoot me. So let's get into this mix. The song is called Drunk by McCall Jet. Yeah, my girls, I know they kind of crazy. Told me to go and take another shot. I don't even drink, but somehow this crown is just all that you got. So go ahead and all right, so here we got everything pretty much laid out. This is I've, I've imported all the audio tracks. I haven't cleaned anything up. I'm going to show you guys that. The whole process, the whole shebang, you guys. Try not to leave out anything. So here in the bluish green, we have the drums. This here in the purple, this pink looking color is is some kind of miscellaneous sound effect or some uh, percussion type um, audio. Then we have bass, which here in the maroon. Then the sample is really a pad, um, and I usually make my sense either brown or this look like purple like fuchsia purple like i don't know fluorescent purple looking thingy uh then we have the hook which is purple lead vocals i normally i tend to make those red background vocals i tend to make those orange i have a reference track here and the black track is my mix bus this is my print track and these Puppy, these five tracks here is like I guess you say a part of my pipeline. So let let's explain this pipeline. As you can see, in between each session sec section from drums, you see a yellow track. This yellow track is pretty much an auxiliary track, which all of these are being sent to this track. So you see, we have drums, percussion, bass. We have synths. Um, we have the hook, we have McCall, and then we have Trey, and we have Trey backgrounds. And all of these yellow tracks are being sent to their respectable buses, which will, we have an instrument bus, which you can pretty much guess that my bass, drums, percussion, synths, all of that is being sent to the instrument bus. I have an ACA, which means acapella. I have a, vo uh, a vocal parallel. I have an effects bus. I have a drum parallel bus here as well. All of these are being sent to my mix bus back up here. I have quite a few plugins on. And below that, I have a print track, which here is purple. So that is pretty much it you guys yeah is that it? yeah that's it so normally when i get a record i like to listen to it from beginning to end several times so i'm gonna let you guys hear it one time <laughs> but you know i'm gonna let's do it several more times after that
control Wanna write until my hands fall off Fill the blue inside the stupid with my soul Wanna write until my hands fall off Till the blue inside the stoop is with my soul Hit the weed one time Are you don't smoke? Hit the weed one time Hot box in the whip Let your feet recline One, two, three, four, five Hit that shit like the race and the kick Know you chasing the kid Searching for the high, high low Cause your eyes get low Anything is possible Let my Johnson know Johnson and Johnson Get about that bell I got ounces though Put that round your nose Think I'm Johnny Depp Bitch, I'm about to blow it All right, so there you have it from beginning to end. The first thing that I normally do is I will group all of the audio tracks and I will take them down. Try to start from the beginning, you guys. So I have the tempo already set, but let's clean up the session, which would be pretty simple. Um, normally, I it, the command U on Mac. I'm not sure what it is on PC. And to get everything good and clean, I zoom all the way in on the audio tracks. And let's go down. So make sure I don't miss anything. Uh, I use kind of, let's go like around like 90. And let's go here. Let's give it some space here let's zoom in make sure that we are not getting rid of too much nope that is it go through and it's pretty simple i hit strip f semicolon and i do that all the way down Until it deletes something that should be there. Like this hi-hat that has disappeared. All right, so now that you heard everything, the next thing that I would do is pretty much clean up the session. You can go in manually and clean up the session by going here and just deleting, here and deleting, or bring everything back. You command Z, I mean command U, sorry about that, using channel strip. Why am I saying everything all kind of jacked up today? All right, so since you heard everything from the beginning to the end, the next thing I would do is clean up the session. 
And how I do that is I will zoom in. As you can see, I've zoomed in on the audio, I mean the audio files and hit down command U and bring up strip silence. And from here, I normally go, it's already set around like 90, negative 90 dB so that I'm getting pretty much everything, not except for like some room noise and every, try to get as close as I can to it without actually hitting any of the important transients, you know? So that looks pretty good. And you hit strip F for the fades, semicolon to go down. And I just work my way all the way down. Oh. And that is pretty much it. So you toggle that back out. And from here, I would like to start my markers. Not record. Let's say we just say start. And she starts with a verse. So I would probably go here, enter. One, of course, let's say one, and we got another verse here. And she have an outro. And it would be the end after that. Let's give it a space here. And the reason I like to go and do this is because if you have a full size keyboard, <clears throat> you can jump between each one of these markers. Say for instance, if I want to go to verse one, that would be dot two dot, and it goes to verse one. If I say you want to go to, um, let's say chorus, two dot I think it's four uh no it's five dot five dot and it goes there and I can just skip straight there that is the main purpose and then it just separates everything so again we have everything markered let's go faders down well let's group everything back up and go faders down and I like to start with Let's say I like to start with the drums because it's going to come in pretty heavy and and it's driving the track. So let's loop this part. Let's make sure we got it loop. And we're going to start bringing in the kick and everything else. All right, so why I brought this up is because I want the VU meter. It's a, a nice little trick that I read. And um, let's, where is this? Um, I read an article. I, I, I have it in the description. I try to make the kick hit around three, 
And then when the bass hit, when the bass and the kick is playing, it hits a zero. So to me, that is a good balance, all right? Especially since I'm working on some headphones right now. Make sure nothing else is interfering with it. There we go. I could break it down. All right. Let's, let's got bringing this bass. All right, so there we have it. Let's start bringing in the snares.
Alright, let's check the ending, get the balance on some of these props here. Shot. I don't even drink, but somehow this crown is just all that you got. So go on ahead and give it to me. Where all my homies did you give it to me? How many chases do I need? Before this liquor starts to sow in the seed. Eyes low, no weed. Hola. Did he say he was rolling the papers? Is it green like the money that made us? Will it get us faded? How many people willing to pay up? Puff past the free, ain't no pay cuts. We're the few jaders. I feel a rhythm in my system like I'm over. Your seat will climb one, two, three, four, five. Get that hit like the bass and the kick. Now you chasing the kid. Searching for the high, high, no, cause your eyes get low. Anything is possible. Let my Johnson's know. Johnson and Johnson, get about that bathroom roll. I got ounces though. Put that around your nose. Think I'm Johnny Depp. Bitch, I'm about to blow. Heavy. Take your soul to another planet if you let me. Trying to be the one that had you stepping into Zeppelin. So charismatic and your vibe is addicting. I'ma run off with the plug if you get me. Hey. Come and hit me. Hit the weed one time. No, you don't smoke. Hit that sh. Hey. Hit the weed one time. No, you don't smoke. Hit that sh for me one time. Hey. Hit the weed one time. No, you don't smoke. Hit that sh for me one time. Hot box in the whip. Let your seat recline. One, two, three, four, five. Hit that sh. Hit. Hey. Hit the weed one time. No, you don't smoke. Hit that sh. Hey. Hit the weed one hey. Hit the weed one hey. Hit the weed one time. All right, so I'm trying to get this A to sound more stereo. So the cool thing about Pro Tools is this great feature called the Clip Gain. So I'm just do the shortcut, bring this up to it. Looks similar like the other one. Let's see what we got. Yep, there we go.
let's not a you guys to death. Hit the weed one time. No, you don't smoke. Hit that shit for me one time. Hot box in the whip. Let your seat recline. One, two, three, four, five. Hit that shit hit like the race and the kick. No, you chasing the kid. Searching for the high, high, no. Cause your eyes get low. Anything is possible. Let my Johnson's know. Johnson and Johnson. Get about that bathroom, bro. I got ounces, though. Put that around your nose. Think I'm. All right. So now that I got a. I think I, I feel like I got a good balance. Let's check this in mono. This will be the only <laughs> plugin you will see me using in this that is not from UAD. Let's bring this down to six. And I think I may just leave this on for the rest of the mix because I do tend to mix in mono. Hit the weed one time. No, you don't smoke. Hit that shit for me one time. Hot box in the whip. Let your seat recline. One, two, three, four, five. Hit that shit hit like the bass and the kick. No, you chasing the kid. Searching for the high, high, no, cause your eyes get low. Anything is possible. Let my Johnson's know. Johnson and Johnson, get about that bathroom, bro. I got ounces, though. Put that around your nose. Think I'm Johnny Depp. Bitch, I'm about to blow. Heavy. Take your soul to another planet if you let me. Trying to be the one that had you stepping in the Charismatic and your vibe is addicting. I'ma run off with the plug if you get me. Hey. Come and hit me. All right, yeah. So the balance sounds pretty there, close. So let's start bringing in some of my mix bus processing. Um, I have basically an EQ which I'm using the Brainworks V3. Uh, because you got the mono on the sides and I normally have this on and this is like a setting that I keep it may be drastic for some of you guys but I, I suggest stay minimal as possible because you can mess up your you can destroy your mix on your mix bus you guys so don't try to be the mastering engineer if you don't understand mastering as well so uh, I would turn this on for the time being because it has my EQ filterings that I like uh, on a, on a uh, mono source. I like to have it around like 30 hertz filtering off. And uh, I have a high pass filter uh, around like 150 on the sides. That is pretty much it, you guys. And I like the shadow hills. And when I hit the shadow hills, I like the I like to, it's a gentle giant. I like to barely hit it, you guys. So let's make sure that I'm not crushing it. Hit the weed one time. No, you don't smoke. Hit that shit for me one time. Hot box in the whip. Let your seat recline. One, two, three, four, five. Hit that shit hit like the bass and the kick. No, you chasing the kid. Searching for the high, high, no. Cause your eyes get low. Anything is possible. Let my Johnson's know. Johnson and Johnson. Get about that bathroom, bro. I got ounces, though. Put that around your nose. Think I'm Johnny Depp. Bitch, I'm about to blow. Heavy. That's fine. And this, it, the Oxford uh, inflator, it makes everything, it, it almost sounds like you paralleling the entire mix because it kind of pushes everything up, you know, and um, it, it brings it more forward, everything. So let's just take a listen. Hit the weed one time. No, you don't smoke. Hit that shit for me one time. Hot box in the whip. Let your seat recline. One, two, three, four, five. Hit that shit hit like the bass and the kick. No, you chasing the kid. Searching for the high, high, no, because your eyes get. And what I'm doing with this, I have the effects all the way up to 100. That's the only thing I'm doing with this. I just like the way that that sounds. Uh, following that, I am using the Manly Master Passive. And this. It's like a setting that I always have used and I've been loving it. So, you know, it works. And over time, my mix bus may change. But as of right now, this is what I like. And with it running through this Manly, the Manly have tubes in it and it warms up the mix as well. So take a listen with the Manly off. 
Hit the weed one time. No, you don't smoke. Hit that shit for me one time. Hot box in the whip. Let your seat recline. One, two, three, four, five. Hit that shit hit like the bass and the kick. No, you chasing the kid. Searching for the high, high, no. Cause your eyes get low. Anything is possible. Let my Johnson's know. Johnson and Johnson. Get about that bathroom, bro. I got ounces, though. Put that around your. It's subtle. I, I'm quite sure a lot of you guys can't hear what I'm doing right now. Um, and the reason I like this is because now, since you can see I have a boost around 16K here on the left and the right, I have a boost around 16K. Uh, I have another boost around 3K. I'm dipping around 500, which is that uh, the mid range. Sometimes I like to push my mid range a little too much. I tend to. Uh, and I have another boost around 60, six, what was it, 68 hertz. And that's the bottom end to make the big sound rounder, fatter. So I won't do too much EQing in the mix. So this is, this is the reason why I'm listening to it through this. Now uh, following that, the tape, this changes, but I like the half inch um, plus six. And I like the GP8. Uh, and that's pretty much it, you guys. I like the way that sound. And again, this I probably leave this on for the time being, but I might turn it up and I'll show you a quick trick when I'm sending this off to a client so that they won't complain that the mix is too low. All right, so let's take a listen. Hit the weed one time. No, you don't smoke. Hit that shit for me one time. Hot box in the whip. Let your seat recline. One, two, three, four, five. Hit that shit hit like the bass and the kick. No, you chasing the kid. Searching for the high, high, no, cause your eyes get low. Anything is possible. Let my Johnson's know. Johnson and Johnson. Get about that bathroom, bro. I got ounces, though. Put that around your nose. Think I'm Johnny Depp. Bitch, I'm about to blow. Heavy. Nine, eight o'clock. Stick you up in the chef. Take your soul to yeah. a. All right, so that sounds great. Now, now I know some people would like to go ahead and start saving this like my, my drum parallel. I didn't know how I wanted to sound. So take a look, make sure I'm hitting it. Hit the weed one time. No, you don't smoke. Hit that shit for me one time. Hot box in the whip. Let your seat recline. One, two, three, four, five. Hit that shit. And with this parallel, what I'm doing, it, it gives it warmth and, <laughs> and punch. So check this out. It, doing this is minimize the moves that I have to do within the mix. So if you understand, so what you, with well, some people, I guess you can say I'm working backwards. All right. So the thing I'm doing is preventing me to make so many moves within the mix. All right. So let's go ahead and drive in some of this parallel. Hit the weed one time. No, you don't smoke. Hit that shit for me one time. Hot box in the whip. Let your seat recline. One, two, three, four, five. Hit that shit hit like the bass and the kick. No, you chasing the kid. Searching for the high, high no. Cause you're... All right, so take a listen to how how warm and how the kick and the snare uh, sounds. It sounds thicker. Without it, it sounds a little thin. But when I add just just a touch, I'm what? Like what I meant, right? Like negative... 27 db just adding that it makes the vo uh makes the drum sound a little thicker take a listen hit the weed one time no you don't smoke hit that shit for me one time hot box in the whip let your seat recline all right with it hit the weed one time no you don't smoke hit that shit for me one time hot box in the whip let your seat recline one two three four five hit that shit hit like the bass in the key and the same for my vocals. Let's make sure that I am getting enough. I'm crushing them pretty good. Hit the weed one time. No, you don't smoke. Hit that shit for me one time. Hot box in the whip. Let your seat recline. One, two, three, four, five. Hit that shit hit like the bass and the kick. No, you chasing the kid. Searching for the high, high no, cause your eyes get low. Anything is possible. Let my Johnson's know. All right, so as you can see, my settings here. The thing I like about the Fairchild is that with the Fairchild, it is, it has what, like over 20 some tubes in it. It sounds amazing. It, it's so warm. You would normally hear people call this or other engineers call this the Holy Grail because how, how great it sounds. I'm using it for crush, but it does sound great when you just use it on a straight vocal. So I'm going to dial this in, the parallel, the vocal parallel. 
hit the weed one time. Now you don't smoke, hit that shit for me one time. Hot box in the whip, let your seat recline. One, two, three, four, five. Hit that shit hit like the bass and the kick. Now you chasing the kid. Searching for the high, high, no, cause your eyes get low. Anything is possible, let my Johnsons know. Johnson and Johnson, get about that bathroom row. I got ounces though, put that around your nose. Think I'm Johnny Depp, bitch, I'm about to blow. Heavy. Eight you up in the chef. Take your soul to yeah. another planet if you let me. Trying to be the one that how you stepping into seconds. So charismatic and your vibe is addicting. I'ma run hey. off with the plug if you get me. Hey. Come and hit me. Alright. Let's go to another part. Yeah, my girls, I know they're kind of crazy. Told me to go and take another shot. I don't even drink. But somehow this crown is just all that you got so go on ahead and give it to me and the same thing with my vocal parallel the vocal parallel is is making the vocal sound thicker and warm all right already you know so now i can just instead of trying to boost up so much low end on the vocals or around like the 200 hertz on the vocal i'm pretty much already there you know what i mean so that would be it for the balance. I have this dip here that is pretty much chilling. Let's find it. I think this is like actually like a little drum loop here. Yeah, yeah my girls, I know they kind of. Yeah, my girls, I know they kind of crazy. Took me to go. All right, so for the drums, as you can see, I have this drum parallel sent on all of them, and they correspond with every panning. All the panning is pretty much the same. So if I change it, it changes as well. All right. Sometimes I will, just sometimes, I will send the bass because it sounds good. Sometimes I will send the bass to um, the drum parallel. But let's make sure like which bass I would like to send. I don't think this 808, but this Moog may. All right, so sending the the bass to my drum parallel, it makes the bass sound a rounder. J just for some is for some reason, it just makes it sound rounder. I love the way that it sounds. Uh, Bobby Oziski, oh yeah, Oziski. I'm making sure I'm not butchering his name. This is a trick that I learned from him, and I love it. You know, and it works. And let me. Maybe just dial it down just a little bit so that it's not doing too much. So let's take a listen to what we have so far. Matter of fact, for listening purpose for you guys, I know some of you guys just not going to get this mono thing. Take a listen. Chases do I need? Boat is slick, it starts to sow in the sea. Eyes low, no weed. Hold up. Did he say he was rolling the papers? Is it green like the money that made us? Will it get us faded? How many people willing to pay up? Puff pass for free, ain't no pay cuts. Would they keep jaders? I feel a rhythm in my system like I'm overdrive. I might be on cloud 19 like I'm super high. I feel a vibe, do you feel a vibe? Pass me another beat, let's get drunk tonight.
one time. Now you don't smoke, hit that shit for me one time. Hot box in the whip, let your seat recline. One, two, three, four, five. Hit that shit hit like the bass and the kick. Now you chasing the kid. Searching for the high, high, no, cause your eyes get low. Anything is possible, let my Johnson's know. Johnson and Johnson, get about that bathroom roll. I got ounces though, put that around your nose. Think I'm Johnny Depp, bitch, I'm about to blow. Heavy, giant, eight o'clock, scoop you up in the chef. Take your soul to yeah. another planet if you let me. Trying to be the one that had you stepping into Zeppelin. So charismatic and your vibe is addicting. Now I'ma run hey. off with the plug if you get me. Hey. Come and hit me. So stay tuned for the next video. We will be working on the drums. All right. Oops. <gasps>